Hello dear friends, welcome to Dynamics Audio channel. We already have a Yamaha Expansion Manager tutorial, however it featured the old PSRS and Tyros graphical interface. Also Yamaha Expansion Manager got some new options in the past few years, so here is the updated tutorial with the procedure shown for the PSR, SX and Genus. The procedure is basically the same, the keyboard's graphical interface looks a bit different now, but in essence it is the same thing working practically the same way. After you purchase the product on our website, it is necessary to export the N27 instrument info file from your keyboard and send the file to us. To do that, please insert the USB thumb drive into the keyboard, press menu and then go to menu 2, then select the expansion tab and finally press the export instrument info tab on the screen to export the file to the USB thumb drive. Now, as usual, you need to plug the USB thumb drive to the computer, attach the file to the email message and simply send it. If you're doing this for the first time, then you should download and install the Yamaha Expansion Manager, the link will be down in the description for both Mac and Windows. If you already have the Expansion Manager installed, be sure to check if it's the latest version, this is very important. Start Yamaha Expansion Manager and import the N27 instrument info file you previously exported from the keyboard. You can do that by using this plus sign and simply selecting the N27 file. Now everything works as before. Yamaha Expansion Manager window is divided in two. The upper part contains your packs, while the lower part of the window shows the content of the selected pack. To import the pack into Yamaha Expansion Manager, you can simply drag and drop the CPF file you received from us to the upper part of the window where the packs are located, or simply use this plus sign to do it. To create the install pack, simply select your keyboard on the left, like this, select the packs you want to be included in this install pack, and simply press save as pack install file or send to instrument if your keyboard has a Wi-Fi module. And here is the first new feature added after we created the last tutorial. It is a message that this particular keyboard doesn't have the ability to play all the new features now available in Yamaha Expansion Manager. This message started showing after Yamaha introduced the PSR A5000, which has some great new features like the advanced portamento and 128 notes drum kit, which are not available on the older models like Genos, Tyros 5 or PSR S and SX. Simply press OK and continue. And now after you press save, there is the second new feature that confuses many. Yamaha Expansion Manager now gives you an option to choose between CQI and CPI pack formats, with the CQI being the quick install, while the CPI being the full installation file. Quick installation is only used when something small is changed inside the pack. For example, you edited some voices and made a volume change or something of that sort. This quick install will take a lot less time to complete and it will not reformat the complete memory of your keyboard. However, any change that adds or removes the sample files or entire packs should be installed with the full CPI pack to avoid problems and corruption of files. Now take the USB thumb drive, insert it into the keyboard, press menu, go to menu 2, select expansion tab, but now press the pack installation tab, select your install pack and press OK. And this is it. After a few minutes, depending on the size of the install pack, the keyboard will ask for a restart. Restart the keyboard and enjoy. Thank you all. See you soon. Bye.